What's going on guys? Jared Sports Cards coming at you on the video today. You guys know what day it is. It is Thursday, which means retail hunting day and a retail hunting topic at the end. So I'm going to try to go to Target, Walgreens, Dollar Tree. I'm going to find like a different, you know, plethora of places um, to, to kind of go into. It's going to be random. So I don't know. I think I'm definitely going to go to Target. I'm definitely going to Target. Um, that I know for a fact, but it's going to be random kind of, you know, everywhere else. I might pop into Walgreens here if I pass this place. You'll see what I'm going to do. If you guys, uh, you know, enjoy these types of videos, drop a like before the video starts. I'd really appreciate it, guys. Um, let's get to the first place. I think it's going to be Target. First place is going to be Target. Okay, so nothing at the first Target, but interesting stuff that I learned. So I talked to the Target employee there and she was pretty much saying that people were falling around the vendors so bad, like 12, 13 people like literally followed her to like store to store, which I don't know how, how many people like have that time. Now, again, you're probably, Jake, how do you have that much time? It's just my class schedule. I just set it up so I have the middle of the day free. But so many people were following her that she is only stocking once per week now. And she doesn't like say anything like she changes her time every single week. So if she stocks on like a Thursday morning at like 9 a.m. one day, next week could be like a Monday at like 6 p.m. So there's literally no way to predict it. You just have to get lucky. Um, so I think I'm just going to start going at like different times. Maybe I don't want to like follow her around or anything. I just want to get there when the restock happens. I just want to follow the restock, not the vendor. I'm not going to do the whole following target target thing. So it's about lucky. So about getting lucky. But right now. We are at another Target, so we're going to hop into this Target and see. This is where I found the Series 1 baseball stuff the other day, so hopefully we can find something. Um, let's get inside. All right, so we went in there, you guys saw nothing. And um, so one thing I didn't really think of until after coming out of Target was that if the vendor stocks the Target that's 20 minutes away from here, why, and like they had nothing, why would this Target have something? Now, again, I've gone to the first Target before and then 20 minutes later came here and they had like a ton of stuff. You can see that in other episodes. I'll put that episode up right up here. Um, it will be like a little card. I don't know, it could be here, it could be here. I don't know how YouTube works sometimes. Um, so nothing that target let's head down to the dollar tree like right near here and see if we can find some like donruss packs or something all right we're here i've never been into this dollar tree um so i don't even know if they have cards but let's check it out usually dollar trees do all right so nothing at that dollar tree either i only went to it because well you just have the nfl sticker collection so nothing crazy but without any stickers so it doesn't even matter when I was driving to the Target, I noticed that there was a Dollar Tree, which I can't believe I've never noticed before. Um, and so I was like, hey, I'm going in, nothing there. Let's go off to either Walgreens or Walmart next. You guys will see, I'm not sure yet. Not sure why I didn't film going inside. This is Walgreens, just for a little context. All right, so nothing in walgreens it's just a really quick trip in there there were too many people like in the aisle for me to like really film and i get nervous when i film like around people because just like i feel like it's weird um so um just that like that re that you know the how do you call it the box with like 100 baseball cards or whatever and then there's like a pack inside didn't grab it but it's whatever so right now i'm at walmart i'm gonna pop into walmart here it is there it is if you can see it here we go I'm not even sure if they have a card section. I assume they do, but I doubt they'll have any cards. But let's go inside, let's check, and then we'll get back to my dorm and I will talk about um, some topics that I want to talk about in regards to retail. All right, so as you saw, just Magic the Gathering cards at the Walmart. I don't know, five stores, no retail. It's been really hard to get retail in my area just because I'm in like a, I'm in an area where there's like a lot of people, but not a lot of targets or like places that sell sports cards. So, I mean, it is what it is. I feel like targets are just like discontinued, not discontinuing sports cards, but like, it's just not like it used to be. I mean, obviously, 
Um, but hey, you know what? It is what it is, guys. Um, power on. Let's get back to my dorm room and let's talk retail. All right, so we're back in the dorm. You know, it kind of stinks that we didn't find anything, but I think, you know, it is what it is. I'm not in a bad mood, though. I just got an insane mail day. You guys will see that on Tuesday. You guys know I'm, I post all my mail on Tuesday. Um, got some insane mail today. I'm super excited. You guys probably know what it is. Um, if you watch my other videos, then you definitely know what this is. So, um, but in terms of retail, I kind of want to talk about what you're going to find. Like if you do find retail, like what's out there right now. So um, first I'm going to, I'm really going to focus on Target mainly. I don't know too much about Walmart. I, I have no Walmarts that really stock cards around me. I mean, they used to like, you know, a year ago and you could find stuff, but have not seen anything at Walmart lately. Like even when I go in, as you guys saw, we were just there and there was nothing. Um, so, but in terms of what you can find at Target, I'm going to be looking here because I'm looking at my computer because I wrote some things down, of course. Um, so Rookies and Stars is still out there. Surprisingly, you will find blaster boxes. I'm not sure how much they restock, but you can still find the blaster boxes at Target, which is interesting because um, I thought they weren't going to stock anymore. Um, another thing you can find, you are going to be able to find um, the... Optic, sorry, um, 2020 Optic Football, that's gonna be out. Then they're gonna be rolling out score soon for 2021 season. Um, so you can probably find that. And then I do believe there's gonna still be contenders for football. So you're looking for four different types of cards in terms of football. Now it could be more in your area, it could be less, but that's at least in what I've heard from people that are in my area, that's what they've been seeing are those four main products for football. Mainly optics, the hot commodity right now, but really any football that you find right now is gonna be um, a hot commodity. Uh, and you might find some playbook. Um, I'm not sure, I'm not thousand percent sure on that, but you should be able to find some playbook. Um, so we'll, we'll kind of see what happens there. Uh, now, in terms of basketball, this is going to be mainly what you're going to be able to find because, again, um, basketball is, you know, in season right now. So, of course, your NBA hoops, that's probably the hottest stuff as of right now, I would argue. Uh, you know, obviously, there's going to be other products that that's begin to roll out that, that are get hot. Um, Donruss basketball, which is probably the hottest product because it came out this week. Um, that's why there's going to be a lot of hype around, uh, the Donruss basketball. So we can maybe potentially start to see NBA hoops price kind of go down as new products come out. Um, and Donruss is going to stay high for a few weeks until people kind of start ripping into more of those boxes. So Donruss, um, and those, I think, I don't know if you can find a mega box, but I know you can find the blaster boxes, the hanger packs, and then just like the gravity feed boxes. Although again, I'm not sure um, if you can find the mega boxes. I don't even know if they make mega boxes for Donruss. I don't think they do, although I could be wrong. I don't know. Someone correct me in the comments if I'm totally wrong. I don't think they do, though. Um, and then you'll be able to find still the draft picks. I've seen draft picks um, videos in, tar uh, you know, the NBA draft picks uh, with, like, LaMelo and his college jersey, Wiseman, everybody in their college jersey. Um, in stores from, you know, just videos that I've seen on other people's channels. So they still have the draft picks. Um, and then there could be more ba basketball products. I'm not too keen, to, you know, honed in on the uh, basketball, but I know you're going to be fine. Hoops, Don Russ, and draft picks as your main. Uh, I think they're still stocking premium stock, although I could be wrong on that. I'm not 100% sure if they're still stocking premium stock. It's kind of hard to gauge. I'm using the information of what I've seen in like other people's videos. I haven't seen too many people find premium stock lately. So in some areas, they could be, um, you know, getting premium stock. Some areas, maybe they aren't. So not sure. Do not call me on premium stock, but there could be premium stock. They could still be stocking premium stock. Um, in terms of baseball, you're going to start to see more baseball products roll out. Um, so right now, 2021 Top Series 1, you can still find 2020 Tops update in some places, not all places. I saw 2020 Tops update two nights ago um, when I was like popped by, I, I had to run into Walgreens for like a non-sports card related uh, topic and I did see some. So um, 2020 Tops update is still on the shelves, at least at Walgreens, although it's probably going to not be on the shelves for too much longer now that 2021 Series 1 came out. For 2021 Series 1, there are blister boxes, the break right there. You can go check out my break. I pulled an awesome card in that break, so go check that out. And then you also have the uh, blaster boxes and... They have like hangers, it's like three packs, and then you get like a bonus card in the front. So you can see the bonus card, and then they just have like the regular packs. So, you know, series one, not too, too high end. 
I've been seeing Bowman a lot around, Bowman Chrome, I believe. Um, again, I'm not too, like, too, you know, big into baseball, mo mostly football and a little basketball. But in terms of baseball, you can probably expect to see Series 1. That's probably going to be the most common thing. If you do find cards at a Target, Walmart, Walgreens, etc., it's going to be probably Series 1 um, baseball is that's, you know, more common, more low end. So don't be surprised if that is what you find. But guys, I'm going to leave you there. Um, if you guys want to check out all the other retail hunting videos where I actually do find stuff, Click this card up top here um, in the suggested videos because you're going to want to watch um, that, guys. But I hope you guys enjoy uh, enjoyed this video. As you guys know, every Thursday I'm going to be doing something like this. Maybe not visiting as many stores. Maybe I'll focus on you know just retail. I do have a rant video for you coming tomorrow because something happened yesterday. I was popped in Target not even for sports cards, just picking up something from my dorm. And when I was in the sport, I really got to check the sports card aisle. Of course, something happened, although I didn't want to bring it up um, in this video. So that'll be tomorrow's video. So make sure to check out that. And then last announcement, Saturday, uh, 6, 6 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'm going to be live. Um, the video is already like the announcement video is already up so you can see it. So go drop an early like Get in the chat early. I'm super excited. Let's have a really nice live stream on Saturday. I'll probably bring in some friends. We'll talk about sports or, or whatever. Uh, but guys, I'm going to leave you there. Have a great day. Peace.